or the safe lane. Yeah, it does. Moo is gonna. They they need a rotation to at least pressure threaten them because you like you said the caustic now is tough. Ooh, Tomato pulled back with the setup from Z Freak. Gets a nice telekinesis. Double shrapnel is gonna be committed here, and uh, that is a seven one versus seven zero melee versus melee. This is just yeah. like a win win here. I would imagine we're not going to be seeing too much bloodshed without any sort of outside interference. These are just two Goliaths just chopping Farm. away at creeps here, farming. Yep. Doom's always going to have the benefit of, you know, devouring some creeps along the way. But look at this. Monkey's committing in hard. Suddenly Eagle shows up, and Monkey's realizes that his battle wounds now are going to lead to possibly some trouble. Meanwhile, Moo able to get the, two, uh, the takedown on Jubei. But as you can see, Freedom will be able to get their own response and Maybe. finally get themselves on the board. Oh, my God. Not before Monkeys gets off a, a hard <laughs> slash. And oh, that's rough because both. Nice time to kind of be a serious fighter here. Oh, they spotted Swindle and they're going to engage right away with the Burrow. That's when Moose steps in and thinks about moving forward for Jube. Swindles goes with the Poison Nova or Poison Touch and that will help in assistance taking down Jube. Beautiful setup, top lane. Response coming out from Freedom here as they look to get Monkeys and they will. Oh, Just a banana eagle. slam. Jana will pick up that one, but look at Z Freak step in and get his own as he gets the grab on the eagle here. Bloodshed Grant. There's all over the place. And now uh, Doom's super happy though, because he's like, ah, I already found a wolf creep. He's just right clicking. He does a ton even to the centaur. And wow, this is a pretty quick paced game everywhere. I think Moo's benefiting the most out of everyone. Bottom lane, they're going on him now though. Ooh, he's going to try to see if he can take Mike with him, but he gets hit with a silence. He gets hit with an arcane bolt, and eagle will get his kill. This is this is the NA dota I knew. Just yeah. d you you just respawn. You go run back to lane, get a kill. That guy comes back, runs to lane, gets a kill on you. Cole always notoriously known to be one of those teams that's happy to scrap. I remember yep. a certain Cole versus Sna game, which uh, definitely a bloodshed here. Top lane doesn't stop. Lift pull back from Z Freak. Him with monkeys trying to get the finish onto Banana Sam Jamma, but he commits out with a scorched earth, and they will both go down. Jubei dishing out the shield will help get the damage. Monkeys though will be able to get the XP from that trade. Bottom lane. Oh, we catch the back end of it. It's Eagle going down. These guys are making it hard for me. Very yeah, hard for me in my camera. Just, I, I have no, they're just <laughs> literally just won't do much damage to 747, and uh, he can just eat and assassinate. Uh oh. Here we go, though. Z Freak with a haste rune rushing on in. Gets the lift pullback. Telkinesis. Tomato tries to stand and fight with some raises, but the DPS is going to be there for Cole. There goes the stampede. What's happening bottom lane is a jump for Eagle here. Moo looking to get the last slash. We'll get it done. Moo, the big bad bear, claims one there. And we'll walk back in a way. Mike not able to offer a lot. Jubei, the shield pop is not going to be enough damage for Moo. And now Eagle comes in. Hits the Arcane Bolt. Is it going to be enough damage? No, it will not. And suddenly Cole have to get back. What it's like each gang just gets one more member, and they, they keep going keep back more. It's like, you know what? Oh. We got this guy. And then BSJ gets solo kill on top. Okay. <laughs> okay, then. What a... BS assassinate, which will do good damage. And if they don't see him coming in, it could be a, a bit troublesome here for Freedom. There goes the first Shrapnel. There's going to be the pull-up on the juicy BSJ target. A big prize net worth takedown will be there for Cole. Jumping up and ahead, Mike's going to be forced to burrow strike off to the side. Tries to go for the TP out. Oh, swinging a oh, They still have to retreat and run. Moo looks to move on in, nice and they're going to be able to get it done. Zephyr had stolen the shield and put it onto Moo. Gets the help. Swindle hits him with a grave. Moo dishing out all the damage. Can he get a second one done? Yes, he can. Zephyr will zap him down with a fade bolt. They're looking to go for three, but Eagle will finally get the takedown. Uh oh, he's BSJ. There. BSJ suddenly shows up, TP's into the shrine, and more on their way. Eagle will end up going down. Z Freak goes for the TP and will make it away. They have no way to stop him. Down and below, Melons also will TP out. Tomato had rotated all the way over, but that's a good win there for Cole. They do end up losing Moo, but they take a couple of names, three to be exact. I don't think they had to lose a Skyrath there. I think BSJ hit him with the Infernal Blade and it popped the shield. Z-Free gets stolen before Skyrath was out of the way and it popped and killed him. But I guess at least they did get moved. They're down about five kills now. But BSJ, once he gets that Midas, is going to be farming pretty yeah. darn quick. It so may I think be he should focus on that maybe. Yeah, it, I was just going to say, it may be buckle down time. Yeah. yeah. For, especially for um, Freedom. They have a Sand King who's looking to get a Blink Dagger, and as oh, you mentioned, tomato, the Midas. Bottom. Yeah, Tomato gets the finish there onto Sniper in oh, the middle, bottom lane, but I'm fight. trying to keep action. Yeah, middle, something's a brewing, and as you can see, it's double Shrapnel's coming out. Z-Freak rolling forward, gets a Telkinesis pull back onto BSJ, and he's done for. Mega kill for the Rubik. Moo, moving in. Here comes the Assassinate. Boom. It will pop some damage. My God, Jubei, no. He does get the deny. This poor guy is a fraction of XP away from level 6. 
If oh, they even kill Z Freak, it will prolong the Blink Dagger even further. Can they get the job done? Moose waiting on the tower, but they have to know trouble could be nearby. They spot out Swindles first, and they will quickly take out the Dazzle. Silenced up, he has no chance to get the Grave. Everyone else looking to bail out here. Can they cancel Moo? Yes, they can. They hit him up with a Doom, and it looks like they'll at least get two from Complexity with Middle. this nice rotation. Mid, oh, very deep dive coming up from Tomato. Nice Stampede, allows the little bit of Go for the defense. Yeah, this is good positioning for Cole, waiting on the outside. Weep's just... wearing off right now, though, so maybe. Let's see, Mike makes his move in, spots it, goes for the solo burrow. Response from Monkeys jumping in, they get the instant burst, but they also get Moo down! Wow. A trade of 1-1, one, one, and a better one there for Freedom. Here comes Tomato, they quickly get the takedown, lift pullback for BSJ, but it is Cole who have to step off. Now the Stampede, they're rushing up forward, they get the blast on. Both Eagle and the takedown is there for BSJ. This is Cole's fight now, as they move on in. They don't even need Moo for this. So they know. Like, Mike's not going to get anything off here. Yeah, there's a ward just up and behind. They'll see him creep down. Z-Freak's waiting. Z-Freak only has the mist coil here. Tries to go for the snipe of the burrow strike, but Mike goes into the sandstorm, and, well, they'll deal with him easily as they have those sentries nearby. It is very disrupting, though, to Cole. Moo eating some extra bit of damage, but we'll be able to go for the finish. They tried to snipe it down. Radiant will get the takedown of the Roche and take up the Aegis there. It's going to be in the pocket of Moo. And now running back it away, it's Monkeys doomed up, trying to rush on out from trouble. Cole looking to disengage with the advantage they've already given themselves. But it looks like Freedom are going to try to isolate Z Freak here. He gets a nice lift back, and he continues to run. Meanwhile, Tomato on the chase for Melon gets it with the raise there. It's a nice little takedown, but not as beneficial as Freedom were hoping for. Oh, Might be a man soon to down. die, though. I heard the roar. I heard the roar. You can hear it like, echo through the yeah. Dota land. Not BSJ, though. He can't hear it. Oh, the mud golem coming, too. He's looking to go for the long ball. Rock stun. And... BSJ has already made his oh, way out. Bottom him. lane, though, with the Stampede. And Mike on the back of an epicenter here tries to TP away, but Z Freak will show up just in time. Sets up the one kill and looks to go for a second, but Eagle will get the silence off and will be able to make it away on the back of a TP. Only Mike to go down here. Jubei nearby. Dire, but I assume it was Dire like, oh, we'll defend that if we need to. And top lane again. Man, Tomato is the split push yeah, god in this but game. But this time I think Cole are en route here. Yeah. It looks like they're smoked. They're walking in. And with them plus the two that are going to probably TP in, they're hoping to get a good fight. Oh, Monkeys barely misses it. Looks like Mike is able to blink away and then burrow to the low ground. But Moo doesn't want to let him go. Continues to chase. Mike goes right for the TP. Can the Slashes get through? Yes, they can. It looked like Zefric was actually able to cancel it at the last second, also with the telekinesis, but regardless, Mike is dropped ports. Dubay. Dubay rushing on in there. They lift him. He tries to burrow off the trouble. The burrow was stolen? No, the mist coil gets stolen up there. Oh, Moo actually Fade misses bolt, blink. But okay, Moo. Burrow strike. Mystic Flare forces out the shallow grave. And he has no Aegis, so they have to get the president out of there. Yo, oh, 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 but look nice. at that beautiful double stun comes out from Monkeys. There goes the Hadouk and the Seder Creep getting involved. Assassinate Blast finishes off Jubei as Zefric secures the mega kill. Doomed up, though, and running away is Mu, weak and wounded. BSJ really wants to get him down, but they're not going to be able to do so. Here comes the Stampede as they surround him and take the significant fight. Oh, he oh. tried to time it and just barely off. Oh, my goodness. So close. Such a good fight from Complexity there. Yep. Uh, that's the problem with Doom. He commits a Doom and he tries to chase down. Are they going to try to use him as bait here? Yeah, it looks the like Cole have smoked and are scanning it out. Oh, they're going to run right uphill to BSJ. Oh, hello. He goes right for the Shadow Blade, but they have that gem. Oh, he is Midas. dead. Midas off Walks cooldown. right into the smoke and will tank the gank. I'll close things out here. Pressure on Freedom. Yep, it's going to be defense. all about Z Freak and that Lotus Orb. Uh-oh, what's happening here? Mid lane, Z-Freak. Moving on in, spots out Mike, trying to TP away, and will easily cancel it down. Sets it up for the Sniper to take it down. Z-Freak will get the last hit, though, and he gets off the concussive shot and will slow stuck. him down. Mike and BSJ will be able to surround Doom. Is he going to try to cancel out the grave? No. Then Z-Freak shows up to help out his brother. Uh -oh. Gets the lift pullback and uses the burrow onto him, trying to hold him and slow him down for the approach of Monkeys here. Steel Scorched Earth so he can keep up with oh them. Oh my goodness. Monkeys is waiting. There's the run in. He pops the pipe so his blink won't get canceled. Oh my. <laughs> and eventually BSJ is going to be forced to Infernal Blade and that will allow Monkeys to step in and 747 will be able to snipe him down.
Nice little chaos there. A long goose chase, but Cole gets it. You're like, wait a minute. They don't no. get it, but hey, look at this. I mean, Mike's inside the base here, in the top lane. What a split push. Zero damage on the top. Uh oh, oh okay. Monkeys wants to make him pay. Mike nice Yules. gives him the Yules and steps inside the tree line. But they're still chasing here. Eagle, Eagle was just up and behind. Mike's oh, going to go for the Epi. Connects it onto two with the Mystic Flare. Is it going to be enough? This Centaur, though, is just too damn big. Shrugs the most of it off. Still manages to live with just about 100 life as Mike is just wounded walking back it away. Oh, man, Mike with the play. Nice burrow back and blink out. And everyone, everyone's coming from different. Oh, 747 could be caught out here. Oh, but he's shadow bladed. And no detection from the dire side. Yeah. And that was, Mike should have died there too. The fact they only lost Skyrim. Oh, Skyra. they might get BSJ. 747 reveals himself and just easily shoots him down. Steps out with that silver edge, and it just hits BSJ hard. This time, you know, the freedom split push is not as scary. Yeah, it's not. Tomato's trying to rush his way down there, but already Kohler are looking to move inside the base here to get the pullback for Jube, and they slash him down. Not even going to get the chance to get off the borrowed time. He's done for. Glyph's going to be committed. Shoot up, so that'd be the yeah, right play. Radiance on uh, BSJ, might influence it a bit. Ooh, middle lane, 7 4 seven. They don't have vision of him. Get him, get him. Oh, no, Eagle. Mike, shot. They don't even care about Eagle. They want to go for the bigger target first and then settle for Eagle. And they do. They'll get him done. Mike able to scoot inside the tree line and TP away. He's a little bit, but it's. Yeah. Oh. oh, I saw that, though. Frantic pings are coming out, 7 4 7 Says they're over there. Mike considers moving in, gets quickly hit with the telekinesis and his own medicine with that burrow strike stolen. Moo jumping in, quickly slashing down, gets the easy takedown of Eagle here. Trying to run back it away is going to be BSJ. He tries to step in, can't even get the doom off. He's done for. Five acts are coming out. This could be the final hold for freedom. Tomato crushing forward, gets off the Requiem, but no good target in sight. They're looking to settle for monkeys if possible, but that's when 747 creeps in from behind. He gets a Hurricane Pike off for BSJ. BSJ is going to be forced to eat the cheese, but he's still getting shot from the back inside, and he's going to be going down. There it is. And that's going to be the game. Complexity will secure this win, and a better seated position for now. They will hold a 4-1 record. And I believe at least be in the second position. Yep. Uh, right under Team NP. Yep. And man, what a, a crazy game in the beginning. And then Freedom, they always seem content with farming and not really moving around the map. And then the, the Vision game we type out. Because even that last ward, right? Yeah. Just the last ward saw the smoke gank. They're like, oh, yep. these suckers are getting baited in. They run in, they just die. Five buybacks, they die again. Freedom are going to be watching that replay and just going, nah.